Welcome back for the one and the only review gamer. And on this time of gamer, we are actually going to be celebrating the very first time here on an episode of our gamer on this day. We'll be celebrating Star Wars Day, which I can see here. I am wearing a Star Wars short shirt. So today we'll be celebrating Star Wars Day with a retro. The movie. That started the company, Lucasfilm Limited, Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope, and Unlimited Edition Steelbook. So anyway, I have done a review on this a while back. Actually, more of an unboxing video on this a while back. That was back in December. But I didn't want to do the review at that time. Because I knew that on May 4th, 2017, it will be... Star Wars Day, so I wanted to do something special for that day. Otherwise, this review would have been a l long time ago. But that wasn't the case. So, that's this. And, so that basically about it. There is some nitpick I do have about the disc inside of it. But that is something to get to later on in the review. So, about these steel bullets, they're not a standard Blu-ray slash DVD case that you would normally buy. That is something actually that surprised me. I mean, I thought that a steel book would just be like, maybe it was just put to as metal and it wasn't really, like, really metal. Or maybe it didn't have like the, all the text on the back of it. But there isn't really no text on the back of it. <laughs> but the only difference that makes a steel book that's different to a... In the Blu-ray case, is that a standard edition Blu-ray case is actually made out of plastic, and a steel book, such as the one I have here today, is made out of like like aluminum, which I can test that out. And um. We will be right back. As you can see here, you can see my Star Wars icon. This will be for today only. So, remember, this icon will be changed back to my regular classic review gamer icon after the um, Star Wars Day is all gone and over with. So, this is what you guys have voted on. I post a link. Um, I have to take that link down now because the voting is now over with. I want to delete the comment that I put on Google Plus. So I had so you, you guys were actually able to vote on Google Plus between two of the most iconic Star Wars villains. And one of them was the one I have here showing Kylo Ren. But the other one, which I thought was the one that would win the most, was Darth Vader. But surprisingly, Darth Vader did not win. It was this guy. Kylo Ren from Star Wars Episode VII: The Force Awakens and Star Wars Episode V I I I I, I The Last Jedi, aka Star Wars Episode Seven: The Force Awakens and Star Wars Episode Eight: The Last Jedi. So we'll be right back in a moment, Carolyn. As I go grab a magnet real quick. And we are back, which I can see we still get to see my icon. Remember, this may not be up. Remember that the icon that you just seen a while back ago may not be up after. You guys might, you guys will only get to see that icon during this episode because it's only a one-time lifetime activity, and with that's why I'm doing this live stream. So you, even when I'm done recording, I will still leave that up for like maybe 20 seconds. Yeah, 20 seconds. 
So I can put like my end screen annotations at the end of this video for like 20 seconds. So as you can see here, I grabbed the this normal flimsy magnet. It's just not really anything metal. So I forgot to grab some of the metal, did I? Well, maybe it's metal. That's aluminum. So you can see the bottom of this thing is indie metal. So the magnet will stick without falling off. So we're going to see and Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> so, you see here, we have a, just a single magnet, which I probably should go that with a can, which I haven't been to here, so I'll just use it. And see, it won't stick. Which. <laughs> I want right here. And you see, it won't stick. So, look, I'm actually touching the magnet to it. So, there's the magnet. It won't stick. So, now I want to see if this case is metal or is it aluminum. Let's find out. There you guys have it. Magnet sticks to... A steel book. Wait for it that way. It won't stick. It was fall down. But magnets don't stick to cans. It only stick. So there you guys have it. A magnet does stick to a metal case. So now you don't now you guys don't want to try this because it might damage your case. So now you know magnet does stick to this case. So now let's open it. Okay, first it does have it does say Star Wars, A New Hope. But that's if it's like Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope, or something like that. Um, and it includes Darth Vader on the front of the DVD cover, which is a very nice tab. So, yeah, I probably should have said what that I'm on. I've only been watching Star Wars for a little time now. I've been watching it since 2016. So, out of all the Star Wars films I've seen, I've seen Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope. Star Wars Episode 5, The Empire Strikes Back. And Star Wars Episode 6, Return of the Jedi. Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. And Star Wars Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. I don't know if I've seen Star Wars Episode 2, Attack of the Clones. I've not seen Star Wars Episode 2, Attack of the Clones. Or Star Wars Episode 3, Revenge of Sith. Or Rogue One, A Star Wars Story. Or Star Wars Episode 8. The Last Jedi. As of this recording, no one has seen Star Wars Episode 8, The Last Jedi, except for the actors, the producers, the writers, and the creators of Star Wars Episode 8, The Last Jedi. Because right now, right now, they are filming Han Solo, a Star Wars movie. So, um, on this spot here, it does say 20th Century Fox, because the, the very first six movies was just Star Wars Episode 1. Star Wars Episode 2, Star Wars Episode 3, Star Wars Episode 4, Star Wars Episode 5, Star Wars Episode 6, was all made by 20th Century Fox. Then it was owned by Disney. Then Disney made Star Wars Episode 7, 
the Force Awakens. In Rogue One, a Star Wars story. And Star Wars Episode 8. Wait, no, Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. Rogue One, a Star Wars story. And Star Wars Episode 8, The Last Jedi. And Han Solo, a Star Wars story. And Star Wars Episode 9. So far, we don't know what Episode 9 is going to be declared as. So, Star Wars. So, I'm pretty in the back. So, there's a front of Star Vader. There's has a Star Wars Episode 4 logo. On the back, it has like the, in the background, it includes the dark side of the force. Um, Kylo Ren, I meant Kylo Ren, Darth Vader. And as you can see there, it does include a mini picture of R2 D2. Um, let me know, let me know in the comments section, the comments section down below if I'm getting these characters right. But I may not be getting these characters right. So, I want to say that's Darth. Vader, which I want to say you spent Anakin Skywalker. Let me know in the comment section, the comment section down below. Um, on the back here we have I want to believe that is R two D two. Um, C three P O. Luke Skywalker. Princess Leia. And in the background, I don't know if you'll be able to see with the dark case. Um, Darth. Darth Vader? I'm not sure, sure. So let's open up the case. So there as you can see, I'll fully extended. So I can see it doesn't have a clint there or a um doesn't you work there like a not only the case I don't think it really does. Um there is a problem with this case I do have. So let me just pop out of the case real quick. Um the DVD and then the Blu-ray disc has been scratched up a little bit right there. Besides that, that's the only nitpick about this disc. Not a big fan of Blu-ray. Not a big, big fan of Blu-ray. So, here it is. Star Wars Episode IV. Where it be? Yeah, IV. A New Hope. I forgot what number it was. I'm not really good at numbers, so. I'm not as good not as the formidable numbers. I just learned it from Star Wars, actually. Like, I learned that Star Wars Episode I is Star Wars Episode 1. Star Wars Episode I, I is Star Wars Episode 2. Star Wars Episode I, I, I is Star Wars Episode 3. Star Wars Episode IV is Star Wars Episode 4, which is the one I have here. Star Wars Episode V is Star Wars Episode 5. Star Wars Episode VI is Star Wars Episode 6. Star Wars episode B I I is Star Wars episode seven and Star Wars episode B I I I is Star Wars episode eight and Star Wars episode I X is Star Wars episode nine and if they make Star Wars episode ten, which I think would be Star Wars episode X. Okay, I think I'm going to declare that, I think. So, um, FoxConnect.com, uh, Blu-ray disc, Lucasfilm Limited, I'm going off the disc right now. Um, probably start at the top, it says, we'll divide the background first, it says IV, then it says Star Wars, A New Hope. Um, this disc is copy protected and stuff like that, you guys don't really care about that stuff. And the Blu-ray disc logo, which... It's just like a <laughs> ribbon. <laughs> it has a Lucasfilm font at the very bottom of the ship. But another case, I would put that in for now. And now I think you're, I think you guys are most excited as this as much as I am. You are here to open and the and show you guys what is behind the steel book. You guys ready? Three, two, one. And there you guys have it. Um, more than I believe this is on the planet called Tatooine. Um, and you see there, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Uh, I guess you kind of can. 
Actually, it'd be able to tell it better. Yeah, I guess you can see the W. It actually says Star Wars. For the, um, it can only tell it in some areas. Like, let me see if I can get it. No, right there you can't. You can get it a little bit right there. You can see it, maybe some Star Wars does say it. If you ever get one, you can be able to say it some like maybe about that much and be able to see it. It's just backwards. It says I C R A T S S R A W. So that's how you spell Star Wars backward. Well, this is how you spell it backwards. W A R S R A T S. No spell. No. It'll be S R A W R A T S. It'll spell Swore Wars. That sounds good. Swar. Rots. Something like that. But it's really Star Wars, so. And just as I want to say that is that little igloo like is was his home, and then you see over here where the this kind of covers it. It'd be nice if you was just like the like that, <coughs> or put a better scene right there. Like oh, maybe in the one where he finds out that he was his father. I think it was in Star Wars Episode Six. I want to say. Um, maybe he will be, has like a picture of them meeting, like, okay, that's Luke Skywalker there, and that is Ashley. So, let me know in the comment section, in the comment sections down below of what would have to be your favorite Star Wars movie. It is Star Wars Episode 1, The Phantom Menace, Star Wars Episode 2, Attack of the Clones, Star Wars Episode 3, Revenge of Six, Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope, Star Wars Episode 5, The Empire Strikes Back, and our Star Wars Episode 6, The Force Awakens, or Rogue One, and Star Wars 4. If I'm able to, if I'm able to put all the Star Wars movies up there, I'll be able to put it up there. So you guys can vote up there, but if I can't, make sure you let me know in the comment section, comment section down below. All of the ones I've seen so far, which I've only seen so many of them, I've seen Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope, which obviously I have it right here. Star Wars Episode 5, The Empire Strikes Back. Um, Star Wars Episode 6, Return of the Jedi. Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. And Star Wars Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. All my favorites are the ones I've seen so far. This might be a shocking to you all. But I read that Star Wars Episode 1 was not the best Star Wars movie ever. Due to some character called Jar Jar Beans. Which I think was his name. I'm not sure. That ruined that movie. But. I don't know. I have a character in my Disney Infinity Collection. Called Darth Maul. Which I was. You know what it's like. It's lightsaber like that. And his, um, one of his sabers, I think it was like the one that went down that way, it was just broke off. But it's still like one of my favorite Disney Infinity characters from Disney Infinity 3.0 edition. A.K.A. Disney Infinity Star Wars, which actually later on, um, uh, maybe I do like an update to my Disney Infinity collection. Because a while back, um, you know what, let me reverse my screen share. So, I can see, guys, yeah, you can now see my screen. And that's what I'm recording now. I need that. My channel. So, I can see. I'm going to change that. Yeah, I did change my. Um, I'll be going back to normal. I don't be able to see it. So right here is my channel art for right now. But I'm going back to that normal red one. It's pretty sad too. Um, there is, right here is the icon for today only. 
Well, Star Wars Day. And that blue screen. There's that one. And here are my videos, of which I have 14,021 views and 145 subscribers. So thank you guys so much for all the views and subscribers. I don't know why I've been the list lately. What's a rat maker? Okay, that's not weird. So... Here on, guys. These are my one, two, three, four. After this one, this one will actually be going down here, which and this one will be going down here. Uh, you guys get the idea by now. So, actually, I think it would be easier to do it this way. Which, hang on, guys. Um, let me just scroll. And you can see, it's been like quite a while since I've done a Star Wars video, which was right here, four months ago, and that's what that haven't done a Star Wars video since this one. Then I went back onto like being the normal stuff I do, and like, and I'm surprised that one has so many views as it does. The top four, the sentence bits, surprisingly for me. <laughs> So, this one, the Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope, still book on box, which I'll push this link at the annotation, maybe. It is 16 views, and the Disney Infinity 3.0 Star Wars Star Pack unboxing for the PS3 has 15. So, Yeah, sorry about the 100 subscriber video special, which I actually forgot to record the video special while back. So I'm actually just going to skip the 100 subscriber video special because I have 100 and yeah, I have 145 subscribers. I would definitely be doing another subscriber for special when I reach 150 subscribers. So please, guys, let me reach up to that mark. 150 subscribers be so grateful if we guys can reach it. If you guys can help me reach 150 subscribers during the 150 subscriber video special, I'll be trying to do 25 jumping jacks. Seem reasonable? 25 jumping jacks? I'm not athletic, so I'll probably fail. Or spice it up some. Do a backflip because I cannot do backflips. So try and do a backflip for the. I want to try and do 75 jumping jacks and try to do a backflip during the 150 subscriber video special for Review Gamer. I'm so excited to announce and see. There, there was the way you can vote for here for the Star Wars Day, which, sorry guys, voting that over. Google Plus, Facebook, Twitter, Social Blade, is and C, and Ready to Rebel. So, I'm actually gonna be doing some all kinds of more reviews. I'll be doing some reaction videos. So, I'll be like doing live reaction videos, but I'll be only in face cam only. But, so, keep out looking for those, which, oh man, I'm so excited. I should be doing some My Little Pony videos, what I think will happen during Season 7, stuff like that, and what I think about My Little Pony. So, anyway, thank you for watching. For I am the one and the only. Wait, hang on. Before I end 
the video for the Star Wars Special Edition video. Yeah, you can see my very first one, like my, my very Review Gamer Episode 2 and Review Gamer Episode 3 and Review Gamer Episode 4 was done in Disney Infinity. Then I kind of just dropped Disney Infinity, then Paw Patrol, then Sophia. Yeah, I haven't done a Disney Infinity video in like a while of time. Disney Infinity... Oh, I'm surprised it has 49 views, but it's actually 100% true. If you guys haven't seen that video, you guys might want to check it out. Um, don't even know why I've done these 360 turn videos. Trying to surprise they're so popular as they are. Like the Disney Infinity Avengers Place to Piece 360 turn, 27 views. The Disney Infinity Hulk 360 turn, 20 views. The Disney Infinity Captain America 360 turn, 16, which was my one of my most popular ones. Disney Infinity Team Ball 3 Sister Turn 137. Disney Infinity Iron Man 22. Disney Infinity Thor 14. Disney Infinity Black Widow 12. Disney Infinity Baymax 25. I don't even know why I've done that. I also done a game review on the Disney Infinity's Collectors app. And I've done a summer at Lowe's with Captain America and Iron Man special. There it is. My Disney Infinity Collection. So. So you can see it's been like. Let me see what year. What they released this at. I had to watch Light Tour. So it says my Disney Infinity Collection review to the Game of Land, Attitude, Share, and more. And it was published on July 1st, 2015. So it's reached almost a two year. Has 19 views. And not a single comment. How many likes and dislikes? Zero likes and zero dislikes, but it's still. So that was my, my very first collection video. Which was like way, 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 way back when I video. When my channel first started. Which. So thank you guys all so much for watching my videos. And. So you know what? Since we're over here, you know what? Scratch it, scratch it, scratch it. I don't want this video to get too long like it is already. I just presented that, bro. I don't even think I can present that to anyone. Sorry about that, guys. We'll see you guys on the next episode of Every Gamer, which will actually be. This is video. What will this be? I lost count. I have a playlist with all of my videos in it. And I this will be a lucky video. One hundred and thirty-seven. So it's in the all my videos marathon, which which that's what it used to be named was called the all my videos marathon, but then I changed it to. All my videos, season one through three. Because actually, actually, I took some videos out of season two. Actually, I might need to re-out them back in or just create another playlist. Because I don't think the Radio Gamer season two playlist is actually getting any views. So if I just delete it and just remake it, one view. And it was actually last updated on April 21st, 2017. So it's been a while since I last updated it. But hey, why do I need to update the Review Gamer Season 2 playlist when we are done and over with with Review Gamer Season 2? But right now we are on Review Gamer Season 3. So if you want to watch my years, Review Gamer Season 1 is all 2015 videos. 
Um, Review Gamer Season 2 is all 2016 videos, and Review Gamer Season 3 will all be 2017 videos. So, do you guys have it? And, I guess I'll see you guys on the next Sunday episode of Review Gamer. So remember, if you guys like this video, please hit that like button. And if you're brand new here, hit that subscribe button. Because I promise you guys this. Once you subscribe, you will love my videos. Actually, I don't know if you love them, but it's the same. Oh my gosh, the sin is too. Oh man, I can't wait till that movie comes out. I should be doing a reaction video to this trailer. I should be reacting, rewinding it, rewinding it, and with the reaction video. Actually, is this the reaction? Is this the trailer? I mean, I haven't been to the trailer. I got, we'll be doing some reaction to movie trailers later on. Actually, I do know. I'm. Um, I'm be doing what I think. What will happen in the sentence two and. Okay, and stuff like that. So, <laughs> what I'm making a new series on what I think will happen, or like what I think what, or like stuff like that, like theories <laughs> and stuff like that. So, remember, keep your eyes on that, on those videos coming out, hopefully, in the near, very, very, very near future. So, anyway, thank you for watching. For I'm the one and the only review gamer. And for you guys, for this. Special edition episode of Radio Gamer. I'll be turning off the camera. So anyway, you guys have 20 seconds to be able to click for the to subscribe. Well, actually, you don't have to just 20 seconds. You just hit the subscribe button down there. So 20, <coughs> 19, 18, 17, 16. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, and the live stream is now over. For I'm the one and the only Ruby Gamer, and I approve this message. So I get to see you guys next time on the next a Sunday episode of Review Gamer. For this has been Kylo.